Welcome to the Bar 101. I'm Frederick Mullen, aka Mr. Mel. Today I'm gonna go over the wiring of um, uh, running the Bar 5.1 with uh, Governor. Um, I, I'm gonna do this on the bench, not do it on the helicopter because it's easier to show here. Um, in a setup, you have the sensor, you have a receiver, and then you have the uh, servos to to the helicopter. When you have the receiver, you have either an like I have here an S bus, or you have the spectrum connector, or you have a full size with each patch cable. Uh, when it comes to um, what you need for the governor, it's just one single cable. It is a sensor pickup, uh, and also the servo or speed controller. But for the sensor pickup, there is one port on this side, the lower port. Uh, that's where the sensor goes. Uh, that's the only one that works uh, for a sensor. But when it comes to actually getting the, the servo or a speed controller to work, there is three different ports. Either you have this servo port on this side, which is good if you have a nitro where you have a servo, a regular servo, but if you're using a speed controller with a built-in back, you cannot put power into this port because it will damage the V-bar. That's why um, the V-bar team has actually, you can select which port is going to be the throttle port. So you can either select uh, the collective or uh, ESE, or you can select channel 4. Both those are okay to put power into or the servo port here, which is not okay to, to run power. So uh, this is needed because if you have a full size um, receiver with all the patch cables, those ports are, are occupied, the speed controller port is occupied, and then you must use channel four or um, the servo port. So the the reason why they have all these different options is because it will ma depend on, on which um, uh, which type of connection you're running and if you have a built-in uh, uh, back or, or power via, via the speed controller. As for uh, many, if you, if you are a pure nitro guy, it's hard to, you don't know anything of speed controllers. But basically, on a speed controller, uh, the throttle cable is the same thing as a throttle servo on, on the Nitro. So it controls the throttle uh, and um, there is basically no difference. That's why uh, the, the governor works on both electrics and Nitros. So what we're going to do is to um, connect that servo to the servo port. But we also need a sensor for the pickup of RPM. On a Nitro, you're using um, regular type, most likely like this one, a Curtis Youngblood uh, sensor, where you put a magnet on the um, uh, clutch or somewhere in, in the helicopter moving. And then you use this type of sensor. For the electric guys, you can put one of those phase sensors. This is a Hyper and it's uh, verified that it works. Uh, and you can put that sensor and it goes to one of the cables on the motor and the other ones go into the sensor port. What I do is, if we do it a little bit like this, I take off the heat shrink on the um, uh, female part and then I solder the connector on the outside here and then I uh, put on new heat shrink uh, on, uh, on everything so it it's connected in a good way. Also, I'm gonna mention these Hyperion face sensors are a little bit brittle here when they're soldered. So what I usually does if I have um, the cable enough, I fold it like that and I fold it like that and then I tape all around so it don't pull on, on the connectors as much as it does if they're um, out like that. You can extend this uh, part if you need to uh, also, what I do is I, I secure this not by straps around here. I rather put double-sided tape on the board and uh, place it on the helicopter. 
So what we're going to do is take the sensor and uh, please note the directions it's on the label so you get it correct. Sensor in the lower port and uh, also the servo in the upper port or channel 4 or speed controller port over there. Mind the directions. So that's the only connection you need to, to run the governor and uh, now I'm gonna jump into the program and show you how we do the base configuration to make this setup work uh, with the radio and uh, what, what the different options are. <laughs> 